It's impossible to live in a world without lead. It's part of our world and it's everywhere, naturally. Our kid's favorite chemistry joke is, never trust an element. They make up everything. Most people don't think about interacting with chemistry, and when they do, it tends to scare them, which can lead to fear like this. But we're dealing with chemistry with everything in our lives. Everything is chemistry. And what makes it worse is when other people exploit that lack of knowledge to spread fear. The people who are proclaiming that they should be seeing zero on their lead tests do not understand how chemistry works and how glaze chemistry works. We recently lab tested a glaze that we had designed and I can guarantee had absolutely no lead in it. And it still came up with traces of lead from the lab test. Now about lead in glazes. Glazes are not made exclusively of lead. All ceramic glazes are primarily made up of a glass former called silica. Silica melts at an incredibly high temperature, so we use other materials called fluxes to bring down that high melting temperature. Lead is one of those fluxes, but it's a minor percentage of a glaze if it's used at all. The glass is still largely silica. Some people seem to believe that glazes or glasses that are clear are not using lead. Let's be clear, all glazes and glasses are inherently clear, lead or not. The reason why ceramics are opaque is because the clay used to make the dishes is opaque. The glaze has nothing to do with it. Glaze is just a glass coating on top of the clay. And glass products absolutely can use lead. Any material used in ceramics can be used in glass making. We're the same scientific field. Glass is a ceramic. Ceramics are not just things that are made with clay. It is a material distinction based on chemistry. There are in fact allowable levels of lead in dinnerware as defined by the Food and Drug Administration in the United States. Now we've seen a lot of skepticism by people about the FDA and not trusting those numbers or that organization. To be blunt, get over yourself. You don't understand how the world works. The FDA is not a perfect organization, but its job is to keep us safe. And you have clean food and water today because of the FDA. So feel free to thank your neighborhood FDA staff members. Make them some cookies. They'll appreciate it.